God is always there and always ready to be there to put his hand in the situation and save the day. And the only way that you could have overcame it or gotten through it was God coming through and working it out for you. It's your boy Jonathan Coleman. I'm here to discuss with you something that's spectacular that's going to happen in the month of July. And that is the release of my single, Save the Day. I wrote it thinking about people that face obstacles in their life or face opposition. In one day, I lost my apartment, I lost my boyfriend, I lost my job on one day. Probably we're at a place where they didn't feel like there was any way to get out of it. And somehow, God came in and intervened in that situation. Monday today is more of a get a clean slate. God's not going to always, always give you what you want, but he may start taking things away from you so you can see what you need. Well, an anthem is more of a tribute to people that overcame the obstacles or overcame opposition. So, Save the Day, to me, when I think of that, um, the first thing that comes to my mind is when God intervened in my life when my grandmother passed away in August. And it was like losing my best friend. So she was someone that I spoke to every single day coming from work. She was my wisdom. She was my best friend. She gave me advice. She was my teacher. Uh, save the day to me is uh, probably when I graduated high school, going the wrong way. You know what I mean? Uh, getting into a lot of things and, you know, coming above the age of 25 and up, still making the same mistakes as I was in high school, you know, and I'm uh, about 30, 29 years old, <clears throat> got some real heavy mess, no details, but heavy mess, and you know, and I got real serious, you know, asking God, you know, to get me out of this. This song is for you, this song is for overcomers, this song is for people uh, that have triumphed and they know that only God could have brought them through. Save the day to me, um, also, as Candace stated, is when my dad passed away. It's been a little bit over two years now. And um, that was my king before my husband. He was my everything. He was my friend. I'm sorry. He was my provider. And when he got sick, um, that just did something to me. So I didn't have a male figure in my life. So it was really hard for me to like believe anybody. I didn't trust nobody. It was just me and my mom. When I lost her, I felt literally like a piece of me. And it was hard because seeing my father at his complete low, I've never seen that before. I've never seen him like that before. So in order for him to get through it, I knew I couldn't do anything else but pray for him. And I've never prayed for anybody else the way that I prayed for my father during that time. You know what I'm saying? And what happened, he got me out. And I had made a promise that I would devote my life to him and everything I do. So save the day to me is that that day when I was in some heavy drama. And it was heavy, but I asked God to get me out and I would devote my life to him. And, and this song is a tribute to those that know that it was God uh, that saved the day, that saved them and brought them out of that situation. God, for me, saved the day because he was in so much pain and so much agony. And when you see your parents going through that and you see the pain, at that point you want God to just take them so that they won't suffer anymore. So I asked God, I was like, if you just please rekindle me and my father's relationship that you know, I hope everything works out and that that male figure can come back in and show me what a husband is supposed to look like. You don't want to miss this. This is going to, hopefully, this is going to be a song that's going to uh, change lives, that's going to change hearts, change minds. And to see a man and then it to be your father come to a point that's so low and you feel helpless as his child and you can't bring him any joy. So when I do see him laugh and I do see him healing and I do see him overcoming, I know that God is saving his dad. It took some time, 30 something years, it took some time, but that saved the day to me, it saved my life. And me and my father, we're working on our relationship because at one time I hated him, but now we're pretending on our friendship and he's showing me what a real man's supposed to be. My father was ready to go, so when he, when he finally, when God finally took him, 
um, he he was no longer in pain anymore. So to me, that helped me. That helped me release my my pain and my anger that I was in because God saved his day, and that's what saved. Like, the day there's was. nobody there to, to 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 pull you through or pull you out. You always got to know that God is there and he's able and he's ready to save your situation and save your day. Put your trust in God. Remember, hashtag save the day, hashtag kingdom music, hashtag, hashtag, whatever. Just, just, just be alert. Just be ready for the updates.